Hey everybody, it's Lon Seiben, and one of the best things about running a YouTube channel about technology is getting emails from viewers about new tech that I've got to check out. And Gambit Rock sent in a doozy today. This is called uh, the Rico Live Switcher, and this is probably the coolest iPad app you will ever see, at least if you're into video production like I am. And what this does for the cost of nothing, it's a free app, will replicate my entire studio. It's a four camera switcher that will stream to YouTube live and make a recording simultaneously. It, it, and it works. It's really incredible. Uh, down in the description link below is a uh, link to uh, a sample that I streamed to YouTube live so you can actually see uh, how all this works. So let's check out the app though. I'm a little out of sync just because of how all my video hardware works and everything. But um, as you can see here, I've got my uh, iPad camera up right now. I can actually switch the angle here to the rear camera just so you don't get distracted by my poor syncing there. And as you can see, I'm able to move that around and uh, get a good preview of that. Uh, if I want that to go live on the stream, I can hit preview to live and it'll uh, cut over there. Now, you'll notice there's four camera positions here. So how do you bring in another camera? Well, what you do is you get an iPhone out. Here's my wife's old iPhone 4S. Uh, you load the app up on the 4S or the 5 or whatever else other iOS device you have. I think it'll work with pretty much anything from the 4S up, including the iPod touches that uh, have the 4S processors on board. And what you do is you load the app up and you could actually run the whole switching apparatus from the iPhone if you'd like. So basically one becomes like the master of all the other devices once you figure out uh, how you want to do the broadcast. And uh, what will happen is, is it'll show up iPhone here at the bottom on my list of available cameras and it's showing up because they're on the same Wi-Fi network. So if you have like a little pocket Wi-Fi router, this will work out in the field uh, pretty well. So you hit the, uh, the little iPhone button down there and what it'll do is it'll ask me on the iPhone if I want to connect to uh, the switcher and I'll say yes. And now it is uh, down there in camera position number two and I can pull it up here. And what's really neat, you'll see I have the, the studio lights going here so it's a little out of, uh, out of focus, but um, I can actually focus the iPhone from the iPad. So I have control over the camera from the control room, so to speak, uh, and then kind of lock that camera position in when I uh, go live with it. And likewise, I can also do the same thing from uh, the phone like it would normally. So uh, really neat. Now, let's, that's not all though, because let's say you want to do you know, a screen grab from your Mac and there's a desktop app for the Mac, and unfortunately not available on Windows yet, uh, but it will take the contents of your screen, like a keynote presentation or a PowerPoint presentation, and also bring it over. So uh, check this out. We're going to go um, over to my list here. I'm already running that app, and I'm going to hit display one on MacBook. And look at this. I've got my uh, keynote presentation uh, loaded up here. And then I can start getting into some really interesting stuff here. So I could say, you know, maybe I want my um, first camera position to be back on me. And maybe I want to do like one of those little things like that. And I can go ahead and switch that live. Now, before I do that, let me show you something. I'm going to switch. Um, now, there's another neat little thing in here, uh, which will allow you to uh, broadcast the program feed over HDMI. So I have myself hooked up to our video system here. And what I'm going to do is um, just switch over to my uh, little scalar thing here. And you can see here I am. Uh, and I'll hit the preview live button. And look at that. Isn't that cool? And then I can go back. Let's go back to my desk shots here, here so you can see what I'm going to do. I'm going to queue up uh, salaries and benefits here, just uh, basically our keynote presentation. And I can make it uh, do that same transition back again. So I'll hit the, uh, the button here. And I have too many buttons to press today, unfortunately. Hit the button here. And look at that. I'm back to uh, doing my other thing. So really, really cool. I am just completely impressed by this. And what's really impressive to me is how well this works over YouTube Live. So this will stream to YouTube Live via RTMP, uh, which is also the same protocol that just about every other streaming provider out there uses. So you can just basically set up where you want to send the video to. And if you've got a connection that's good enough, it will uh, output it there. And you've got uh, the RTMP options here under my channel. Um, I set it up for my YouTube Live. I did a sample broadcast that you can check out in the description link below. Uh, really works out very nicely. Now you also have some options for recording. Um, you, you will record the same time you broadcast. You'll always have a, a copy saved on the device itself and those are accessible up here. Um, so I think I can actually watch it here. So this is the one I did upstairs and this is the one you'll be able to see um, when you go to my YouTube channel. Uh, you cannot record in full HD on this version of the app. So there's another app that costs five bucks. Um, I believe it's called the, uh, uh, they call it Multicam. And it works the same way, it just doesn't stream, but it will give you a higher quality recording. So that app is five dollars. 
Uh, this app, as I said, is free, um, except if you want to get rid of, and I'll pull this up real quick, if you want to get rid of that Rico Live switcher thing in the lower right-hand corner, um, you have to pay $11.99 or something, $11.99, and it will unlock that for you. And quite honestly, that's a bargain. 12 bucks for a four-camera switcher is like the cheapest switcher on the planet. And, uh, that, and, and it works with YouTube Live, which is my uh, streaming uh, app of choice. Now, am I going to use this all the time down here? No, I've got you know, all this equipment that I paid all this money for. So I'm going to stick to that. But if I'm ever out in the field and I really have something happen that I want to uh, do some cool like on the, on the spot uh, live streaming with multiple camera positions, I'm going to take out my iPhone 5S uh, load up a couple cameras from my friend's iPhones and stream uh, from wherever I am. And that is just uh, uber cool. So um, you can do a couple other things just before we close this out. Um, you can uh, change the transition that you want to use to uh, move between things. So you can have the cut like, the, like I use on this switcher here, just a straight cut. But you can do a cross dissolve, which is a little, you know, a little bit nicer. You can do the wipes. There's little cube things that you can do. Uh, you can also set um, how you want that picture in picture to look. So for example, if I pull up my face here again, I can uh, do this or do the reverse. You can actually add um, three uh, items in if you click on the dashboard mode here in multi view. So um, you can do a three up here as well. And there's also a picture in picture option. Uh, and you can basically just tap to your heart's content. And then when you want to go live with it, you just uh, hit that live button and uh, it will transition over to that. So you can see my screwed up <laughs> picture here. And you can then fade out the black, of course, as well. So um, I am just, uh, again, I can't say enough about this. And it's free. So go download it, play with it, see what you can do with it. And uh, we'll see what they develop with this as time goes on. But a big thank you to Gambit Rocks, because I would never have heard about this if he hadn't emailed me. So if you have stuff you want me to check out, uh, send it to me. I am happy to do that, because this is like an example of some really cool stuff that I love to share with folks. And uh, definitely send it my way. This is Lon Seibin. Thanks for watching.